life is not gonna be perfect. We understand, oh, you wish you had this. You wish you had that. Oh, I wish that didn't happen. Oh, I wish this didn't go like this. We understand, okay? But you complain about it, it's not gonna change anything. Like. I am Karis, and today, as you can tell, you know, where I'm at in my room, you, it's going to be a sit-down video today, and today we're going to be talking about how to be a happier person. So, guys, the reason why I decided to film this video is because, like, everybody always asks me, like, Karis, how are you such a happy person? Because, like, y'all, I'm a happy camper. Like, I'm always a happy camper. I always got amazing energy whenever you see me. Like, I'm very nice, and, like, I just have this, like, energy about me. And honestly, y'all, like... As long as I can remember, I just always like been a happy person. Like I, I've always been like a happy person. It takes a lot to really get me down or like, I mean, besides my attitude problems, it takes a lot to like get me upset or like get me mad or in a bad mood. To be honest, it really takes a lot. Um, I'm really happy all the time, and it's like everybody that I come across asks me, "How are you so happy?" And like y'all, I wrote that some tips. I really thought about it. And I'm like, Karis, how are you always so happy? Like. How am I always happy? So I wrote down some tips. So if you see me looking down, you already know it's because I'm making sure I'm staying on track and I got these tips written down for y'all. But y'all, I just I've always been happy. Like I feel like it's I feel like it's like on how I was raised. Like in the household I was raised, and I was always very I, like a very happy child. Honestly, I never was like a mad child or an unhappy child ever. I always was happy. So I feel like that has a part to do with it as well. But I feel like these tips I'm about to tell you also have a part to do with it and how I keep like because I'm not a child anymore I'm 19 years old so I'm not like those I mean I feel like I have to be happy on my own I have to choose to be happy you know so without further ado I'm about to get into this video but first please remember to like comment and subscribe you guys it helps me out a lot and please comment down any other videos that you may want me to do guys and let's get into this video you guys so the first tip that I wrote down is wake up on the right side of the bed you guys like when you get up in the morning let's say okay today's gonna be a good day like today is gonna be a great day today oh i feel amazing like let's speak it into existence because i feel like you could if the i feel like it depends on how you wake up like if you wake up and you like feeling bad then it might be a bad day and you don't try to like make yourself feel better all right it might be a bad day i'm gonna be honest it might be a bad day because i didn't have days where i like wake up and i'm not feeling the day and like I'm just not feeling it like it's just it's just a meh day it's not a happy day it's just like a meh day it's like a I'm here day but then I had days where I wake up I'm like oh I feel I feel so good so it's gonna be a good day and my day is actually a good day like honestly a good day so I feel like if you start like waking up with the mindset like okay today's gonna be a good day um no matter what happens I'm gonna have a good day today like okay this may happen but I'm gonna have a good day today like if you wake up with that mindset you're gonna have a good day because you you're believing that you're gonna have a good day i feel like it's always on the mindset like if you're in the mindset of like oh i'm gonna have a terrible day today you're probably gonna have a terrible day today because you spoke that into existence but if you speak into existence oh you know today's gonna be an amazing day like i'm gonna do everything like i'm gonna do everything that i want to do today everything's gonna go as i want it it will go as planned like honestly you will have a great day like so i feel like it's really based on your mindset and like how you start your day off like if you start your day off with bad energy it's just a no for me so make sure we are starting the day off right guys make sure you're getting your breakfast make sure you were saying your affirmations whatever you gotta do to get your day started and have a good day make sure you're doing it, okay just just do what you need to do to have a good day because it really starts with how you wake up in the morning honestly i feel like the that's just how it starts the next tip that i have for you guys is to stop complaining guys Y'all need to stop complaining about your life. Okay, guys, we understand everybody's life is not going to be perfect. We understand, oh, you wish you had this. You wish you had that. Oh, I wish that didn't happen. Oh, I wish this didn't go like this. We understand, okay? But you complaining about it isn't going to change anything. Like, are you going to do something about it or are you just going to talk about it? Because if you're not about it, then, like, what are you talking about it for? Like, I can, I can always complain. that like, I can complain about any... I can complain about a lot, you know what I'm saying? And, like... I'm, I'm very blessed in my life, but I can still complain. Like, I can still complain. But, like, I, am I going to complain? No, I'm not going to complain because I am happy with my life. I am content. I am blessed with my life. I'm not going to keep complaining because when you complain, y'all, it's like, it's just like poison. Like, it's just like you poisoning yourself. You just, oh, I wish I had, I wish my hair was like this. Oh, I wish I had this shirt. Oh, I wish this, I wish that, I wish that. Oh, I hate this shirt. Oh, I hate that. Wait, that is just, 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 that is
dang, like, dang, like, you think you're gonna be happy? You think you're gonna be happy when you talk about yourself like that? You think you're gonna be happy and all you can think about is negative? Come on, y'all, like, no. So y'all need to stop complaining and y'all need to, like, think about what y'all do have. Like, hey, I don't have this, but at least I have that. Oh, well, that didn't work out like that, but maybe it'll work out a different way. Like, maybe I didn't need that. Maybe it's a sign. Like, start like looking at the positive side of things stop looking at the negative stop complaining because i'm tired of hearing everybody complaints like stop it like stop it you want to know why you're not happy because you keep complaining about your life that's why you're not happy okay that's why you're not happy so if you want to be a happier person stop complaining and start being grateful for what you have start looking at things in a different way glass half full not half uh what is it half empty glass half full not half empty okay like fix that Honestly, it just goes into mindset, y'all. Like, all these tips really go back to your mindset. Like, you need to just fix your mindset. Like, start your day off right. Stop complaining about your life. Everything's gonna work out. If you believe everything's gonna work out the way it needs to work out, it will work out how it's supposed to work out. Period. No ifs, ands about it. I don't wanna hear no excuses. Like, stop complaining. And I promise you, when you start complaining, you start looking at things a different way. Like, hey, you know what? Maybe this was meant to be like this. When you start looking at your life like that or looking at certain things like that, you will become happier, okay? I mean, honestly, you will become happier. And I know, like, some, like, I know stop being, like, stop complaining. It's, like, hard, harder to do than, like, just saying stop complaining. But honestly, you guys, I used to be a big complainer. I used to complain about a lot of things, but... I don't complain like I used to anymore and honestly I feel like it, it's definitely made my life better for me like I'm definitely more like grateful for what I do have and grateful for like a lot more things in my life than I was before and I feel like it's because I just stopped complaining like and I just started to realize that like everything doesn't have to go my way you know sometimes it's good that things go a different way because it shows you things that you didn't even know you needed to see honestly so stop complaining about your life and I promise your life will get better okay you'll be happier the next tip that I have for you guys is be optimistic. It kind of goes into what I said about stop complaining. But being optimistic, you guys, you need to be optimistic with everything. Like, try to be optimistic with everything. Even when it's, like, something that just, like, grinds your bones. Like, try to be optimistic about everything. Like, hey, um, let's see. Okay, um, so let me just give you a short story time. So yesterday, you guys, I was in my car and I popped my knee out of place. Um, trigger warning. I'm so sorry. If y'all have like a little trigger warning, this might be a little triggering for some of y'all. But I popped my knee out of place um, yesterday morning before work. And I had to pop it back in place. And that was like the first time I ever did something like that, you guys. I mean, I, I can't even believe I popped it back in place. But And I had to be at work at 6 a.m. So I, I clocked in for work and I'm walking. I'm trying to make it through a day. But I'm like, hey, I don't think I'm going to be able to make it, you know. So I go home early and I go to the urgent care. The doctor says everything's okay. Just get some rest and like ice and stuff like that. And like, honestly, I could have I could have sat there and really like sat, been so negative about my day and been like, oh my God, why did this have to happen to me? Like, oh my God, my knee freaking popped out of place. Why did this have to happen to me? Like, why me? Why me? I could have been that person. But instead, like, looking back on the day, like, I was just very content with my day. I mean, my boyfriend came home, he took care of me, you know, he made sure my leg was okay. He was really, like, taking care of me. He was giving me ibuprofen, ice in my leg. He was just doing what a good boyfriend should do. But honestly, y'all, like, I'm glad that happened to me because I got so much rest yesterday. Like, I took a, a like, a two-hour nap, y'all, and then I had a great night's sleep, like, last night. And I'm very, I'm like, I'm glad that I had that, that that happened to me because it gave me the rest that I didn't know I need. Like, honestly, like, I, I would have never got that good sleep if it wasn't for this knee. Like, so, I could have kicked it like, oh, this is the worst thing that happened ever. But I kicked it a different way. Like, at least I got the rest that I needed. Like, because I got some good rest, y'all. You know, you know when you get that good sleep. Like, okay? So, that's like an example of how you can be optimistic. Like, yes, I could have kicked it like, oh, my... Like, oh, my leg hurts, my knee hurts, all this, that, and third. I could have been so negative, but I was not. I was very much positive about it, you know, or trying to be as positive as possible. I want um, a positive as possible. I was on leaping lizards now because my knee popped in place, but, like, I was trying to look at the positive side and tell myself it's going to be okay, you know, just take it easy and do that. Like, just be optimistic, guys, because when you be optimistic in your life and when you be optimistic with certain things, certain outcomes, you're, you just have a, like, you're, you're just going to be happier as a person because it's like, I'm not so worried about the negative. Like, you know, I'm focused on the positive. And I think we all can, like, do better with being optimistic. Even me included. I can even do better with being optimistic sometimes. So sometimes I catch myself falling to the negative. But I quickly try and check myself out of that, you know, mindset. So 
I definitely feel like being optimistic is another another like way you can be a happier person. So the next thing is going to be stop being so hard on yourself. Um, guys, I understand 2023 is ending. We all have these goals that we want to accomplish by 2020, the end of 2023, guys. But stop being so hard on yourself. Stop putting so stop putting so much on yourself, I should say. Cause sometimes it's good to be hard on yourself, but stop putting like so much on yourself. Cause sometimes you get overwhelmed and it's just like you just like when you get overwhelmed, it's just like, how am I supposed to do this? How am I supposed to do that? How am I supposed to do this? Like, oh my god, my life is so crazy. Like, blah, blah, blah. like you just start complaining about your life and it's just like stop. Like, it would be okay. Like if you don't hit certain goals by the end of this year, it's okay. Like, as long as you tried your best to, that's all that matters. Like, A for effort. A for effort, guys. A for effort. Remember, A for effort. But I just want y'all to stop being so hard on yourselves because I feel like, for me personally, I feel like I'm very hard on myself sometimes. Like, sometimes I try to do everything. Like, literally everything. And I know doggone well that I cannot do everything by myself or everything just in general. Like, sometimes you gotta pivot. Like, sometimes you just gotta, like take it step by step by step and I forget that sometimes so definitely stop putting so much on yourself and like ease your load up when you have to like it's okay you're not weak ease your load up you need to like especially if your performance is gonna be so much better like sometimes I try and do everything and my performance is like trash on like like I slack on things you know what I'm saying so by me helping like helping me take it step by step and like ease my load down it helps me a lot because I can like be proficient and have the best performance in the things that really matter to me like you too so definitely like stop putting so much on yourselves guys well like, i know you're doing a lot i know you're trying i see you trying girl i see you trying boy like don't even worry about it like ease your load up like ease your load up because it will definitely help you like appreciate your life more and be more happy because you cannot be happy when you run down and you like just tired like if you're just tired get some sleep honestly like get some sleep you'll feel so much better when you get some sleep but honestly guys like just like really Stop putting so much on yourself because when you put like a lot on yourself, it's just not, it's not healthy and it's not helping you out at all. So stop putting so much on yourself. And then the last thing that I wrote down was love your life. Guys, we need to start loving our lives more. Like, um, it's easier said than done, I feel like for sure. But like, sometimes you just have to like focus on yourself because you know, sometimes I go on Instagram and I'm like, ooh, I wanna be like that, I wanna be like this, you know, I wanna be like that. But like, you have to remember, like, your life is your life for a reason. Um, God put you in your, like, in your shoes for a reason. And you have to just keep thinking everything happens for a reason. Like, you have to think that, like, even though I don't understand, it will all make sense in the end. And when you understand that, I feel like when you really grasp that and really go by that in life it, it makes your life a whole lot easier and it does make you happier as a person um like i said i'm content with my life um i'm very content with my life it's not like it's like you can want for things like i want for things but do i need anything else no i don't like i look on instagram sometimes I'm like i really would like to be like that like I would love to be like that. i look at other youtubes i'm like wow like if only like what if i had that many subscribers like what would i even do with that like and it's like, I'm not rushing myself or anything. I'm not trying to, like, be greedy. I'm not trying to be envious or anybody else because I know my time is coming. I know everything that's in store for me will come my way. I just have to be patient and keep grinding on my end and doing the work. And everything will turn out how it's supposed to turn out. And if you believe in that, like, if you believe like that, you definitely will be a happier person. Like, everything happens for a reason, you guys. Like, I just stay telling myself that even when I feel bad. I'm like, ooh. Why didn't this happen? Like, ooh, why this? Why that? I always just tell myself, you know what? It's fine, here. You know, it just happened for a reason. Even when, even when some things like really just bother me, I'm like, I'm like, you know what, Karis? It's fine. You know, we're not gonna, we're not gonna get mad that you know somebody's just having a bad day. You know, something could just be happening with that person. It's fine. Like, we don't need to like mess up our whole day because of this, you know, of an incident, a small little incident that happened. You know what I'm saying? So like love your life guys um very be very content with your life be grateful for what you have stop thinking about what you don't have like it doesn't matter because everything that you need is what you have everything that you possibly need to live is what you have so honestly guys like that's all i have for you today being a happier person like for me it's just basically all those tips i just said like you just have to like live by them and just 
bitches and I also like being and I also well, I was gonna say I like being a happy person but I'm sure everybody would like to be a happy person but honestly like I like being happy I like being like that energy because like it catches a lot of people off guard like a lot of people let me look like Karis why are you so happy like wait a minute Karis why are you so happy all the time like Karis it's, it's like it's the same like I, sometimes I be at my job it's the same I'm happy I'm loud like I'm there like I'm energized I'm there they ask me like how it's like I'm just like happy like I just be happy I just be smiling like cause it's like why do I need to be mad like what is me being mad gonna do for anybody like we all could be mad at the world and mad at what's going on in our lives but that's not gonna help us so instead about instead of um frowning about it why don't we smile about it you know what I'm saying also smile more I feel like smiling more makes you happy too <laughs> like I know some people be like don't tell me to smile but like smile more when you smile more you look like even happier like you feel happier because like i'm smiling i'm cute you know but guys that's all i have for you guys today i hope you like the videos please remember to like comment and subscribe and please tell me what you will whoa whoa mm. i'm sorry guys i'm getting so tongue tied this video but please let me know if you guys want to see any other videos from me and smash that sus subscribe button subscribe button i cannot talk and I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I hope y'all would get happier. I hope y'all would become happier people off of this video. Because honestly, like, y'all, I just love being so happy. Like, when you're happy, you get a nice glow about yourself. You're not stressed. you blessed. Like, it shows, okay? But, guys, I'm out. Peace.